segregation authority. authority. Yes. Well, if you're a homeowner, start over. If you own property in Orange County and it's an investment, you are going to love what we are about to share with you. Jennifer Castillo with Cost Segregation Authority. Yes. She's basically a treasure hunter and she can find a treasure that you don't even know you've lost. Jennifer, mm -hmm. thank you for taking time out of your busy schedule to join us today and talk to our Orange County commercial property investment owners. Mm -hmm. And I'd love for you to share with our viewers mm -hmm. what it is that you can do for them to mm -hmm. find lost money. Uh, my firm specializes in cost segregation, which is a very, very valuable tax strategy uh, for anybody that um, owns commercial real estate or residential rental real estate, um, any income generating property. Uh, what cost segregation does is it allows you to accelerate the depreciation on different components of the property that you own in order to maximize the tax benefits that are available to you. Um, so a, a great e example that I like to use is um, example of a carpeting in let's say your commercial property um, that's really a five-year asset. Um, your landscaping and land improvements outside of the building that are a 15-year asset um, and so on and so forth. And so we reclassify components of the property um, in order to accelerate the depreciation on it. Okay. Yeah. So in a sense it's kind of like instead of, um, I guess most commercial property owners mm -hmm. do a short form tax return when it comes to uh, breaking down their depreciation mm -hmm. on their properties, mm -hmm. but you actually go down into the nitty gritty and use a long form itemizing the deductions that would be exactly. for the property, separating the actual real property from um, all the improvements right. to the property. I exactly. It, it's separating uh, the real property, the Section 1250 property, from the personal pro the property that can be classified under IRS tax code as personal Section 1245 property. Um, so exactly, it's a, a great illustration. Yeah, Fine. great parallel. Fantastic. Yeah. And how about if how about if you have somebody who uh, sold commercial property? let's say one, two, or three years ago, is there any way that they could yes. benefit still? Yes. There so th so th there are several scenarios in which a cost segregation study can be performed and should be performed in. Um, first is for property that's currently owned and currently a part of your portfolio, um, but secondarily, property that has been sold within the last three years and are currently not a part of your portfolio. Um, and what happens is if you go back and we do a look back study over the last three years, there can be an opportunity for us to get you a refund on overpaid taxes um, that you would have never otherwise realized without this study. So what happens is the way that the allocation of um, the gain is taken on the sale, we shift things more to a beneficial um, and advantageous tax bracket in the cost segregation study. Okay. Is this something that the IRS uh, looks at kind of mm -hmm. as a risky uh, thing to do or does this red flag somebody's tax returns if they do a cost yeah. Unequivocally no. Um, it is something that is absolutely not risky. It, it is not a, an overly aggressive tax strategy. It is something that is approved by the IRS and pr is per tax code. Uh, it does not in and of itself flag an audit. Um, there are scenarios of course that anybody can come under random audit but if that is the case, we certainly have all of our legal arguments and all of our backups that allow us to um, perform these studies and uh, allow them to be uh, withheld and upheld by the IRS. Yes. Great. Um, my firm, uh, we meet, of course, all of the IRS criteria to conduct these studies, uh, which is uh, we have uh, construction engineers as well as licensed CPAs uh, who work to, to perform these ultimate studies. And I understand uh, that your company has done over 6,000 of these cost segregation studies. Yes, and, and the number is actually, I'm sure, quite north of that now. Um, but uh, yes, uh, we've conducted studies nationwide. Uh, we travel the country um, every day in order to perform these for, for building owners across the country. Uh, but I love Orange County, love California. There's a great opportunity here because of the high property values uh, to, to make sure that we are uh, pro providing a great value to to those here in Orange County. Fantastic. Well, in behalf of the Huntington Beach commercial property owners, I appreciate your sharing this knowledge and this wisdom. Mm -hmm. And if you would like more information on cost segregation analysis, just 
contact us with the link here that's on the left hand side of the website. We'll be sure to put you in connection with Jennifer. I look forward to seeing you again on the other side. My name is Lillian Walker, broker for Exit Beach Cities Realty, helping you exit out of where you are and walking into the home of your dreams.